This is your kids hmm? favorite YouTube channel DP Kids. Yes. Learn how to draw cute animals in this fun drawing tutorials. It's the more popular among kids. Yeah. Why don't you tell our viewers to how to find us? Search our YouTube channel DP Kids in YouTube. And then how we continue? Subscribe us and click the bell button so you can get more updates. And don't forget to like and comment after watching this video. And from that we can improve ourselves and bring this program to another level. And very interesting. interesting. On my way, I saw a nice flower. Can you guess that? It has uh, five really? petals. Let's see. What would be Malaysia's national flower? What do you say? Show flower, isn't it? Exactly, that's correct. So, I thought to draw a lovely flower with these lovely kids who loves the environment very much. These drawing tutorials show you how to draw a shoe flower step by step. Binod, do you like drawing? Yes, I like it so yeah. much. Yeah, every kid do like to draw flowers very much. So, let's start. I'll show you how to draw and add patterns. The first step in how to draw a shoe flower is different. Unlike drawing animals, <laughs> it doesn't include any eyes or mouth like that. Yes. Okay, we should start drawing in the middle of the paper. First of all, just draw a small curve like this. Uncle, I have a question. Yes, tell me. You can ask the question. Uncle, is it true people use part of the hibiscus plant to make a drink? To drink. Yes, I want to know that. Yes, exactly. There are lots of shoe flowers for that purpose. This drink is very good for your health. Flowers are offered to God and Goddess in Puja. Yes, I have so, seen it. Flowers always play a major role. And um, also, this flower is special as its petals have the unique ability to emit divine consciousness. So, we'll talk about the shoe flower more and more yes. while we are drawing it. So, uh, shall we move on? Okay. Okay then. Let's start by drawing a curve right here in the middle of our paper. Right in the middle of that, draw a line like this. Pollen of a flower. Yes. Then, we are going to try another one right next to it. We also have a plant of this species in our home. Oh, that's awesome. Alright then. Okay, now on the end, let's draw a couple of bumps like this. That's correct. Now at the very end, let's draw a bunch of little round circles all around. If you have seen this, it would be very easy for you. Always pay attention to your surroundings and it will help you to create a wonderful piece of art. Like this, fill them with the circles. Finished? Cool! And then... Okay, great! Now, we are ready to draw the petals. So, let's start drawing starting from here. Like this. As they are much bigger, we are going to draw a bigger curve like this. Okay. Yep. Then, we are going to draw another kind of wavy line which comes like this. Just a bit further. That's right. A little bit further. Then, after that, connect right here. Okay. Let's draw the next petal above this one. You can start from here. Exactly. Just draw freely. Back into that curve, you could draw it there. 
Okay, we are going to draw a wavy line that comes out so we can start right here. Okay, again, draw a curve shape to connect it like this. Okay, now let's draw another petal right next to this one with a slight curve. Okay, shall we color it? Yeah. Sure. Let's take yellow and red. Now we'll break it into two, just like this. Let's take yellow and red. Now we'll break it into two, just like this. Carefully. There's no rules. So let your imagination run wild. Blend the colors inside out without smudging. You can use the red color and use it carefully like this. We can color this area a little bit darker like this way and we can fill the shape like this. Uncle, can we use our thumbs to add shades? You don't have to, because you can do it from the crayons. Let's fast forward. We had fun drawing today, right? Yes. Shall we show it? Okay, sure. Although blending looks complicated, it's quite easy. This tutorial includes tips and techniques for making your flower more realistic. <laughs> Hope you learned our easy steps with DP Kids. So, today you learn how to draw a flower in this fun, easy step-by-step -step drawing lesson. Yeah. Is it? Yeah. And so, till we meet up again with the beautiful creation next time a wonderful creation stay with us yes. see you soon good, good luck, luck.